back. No, that wasn't part of our deal. But it's not necessary to destroy stars. What about my family? What could Barry be talking to in there? Hmm. Yeah. Well, yep. Everybody on the ground. <laughs> she just yeah. kicks the door in. Barry! I've been muted. How long? I don't know. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's gotten into you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm all right. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Don't worry, I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. Yeah, I have no idea how long I've been muted. Oh, man, that's sad. I mean, it's bound to happen every once in a while. Oh, because I muted for the whole other episode? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, do you want to check? Yeah, I'm going to check. All right, we'll be back. Screen. All right. Okay. <laughs> Dodge the it. bullet. It wasn't for that long. <laughs> okay. So I was muted. Oh, man. I'll put text on the screen of what I was saying. Mm -hmm. Sorry, but... Got to hear Ben's beautiful voice. Oh, thank you. And you got to hear me a little bit in Ben's microphone if you have headphones on. Actually, yeah, you, you were coming through pretty clearly from what I could hear. Um, okay, so I have this if you're watching on a TV or something, mm -hmm. boned. No going out. Just more work for me to put the cool text on the screen. <laughs> All right, so I think. So Barry's up to no good, making yep. trouble in his neighborhood. Plant, Ooh, we have documents. Oh, Plant 42 report. Four days have passed since the accident. The plant at Point 42 is growing at an, at an amazing rate. Wow. Mm. Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with other group of, of the plants, the T-virus has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. Yum, yum. The T-virus has drastically morphed its host's anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on Earth will you find anything like it. <gasps> We've also found that Plant 42 has two main sources of acquiring necessary nutrients. One source is through its root. Somehow it has rooted itself down into the basement. Immediately after the accident, the scientists went mad and destroyed the aqua ring. Ever since, the basement has been like a pool. There is a high possibility that it's one of the chemicals in the water that's promoting Plant 42's rapid growth. Mm -hmm. However, we have yet to determine the specific chemical. A bulb-like body of the Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling of the first floor. We are sure that it used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Numerous long tentacle-like vines are protruding from the bulb. We believe the vines are the second means of, of acquiring its nutrients. When the plant 42 senses prey, it uses the tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. <laughs> After doing so, suckers on the vine drain the prey of its blood. Ooh. Vampire plant confirmed. We have the documents, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it says tentacle. <laughs> yeah, it does. We've also noticed that it has some intelligence. When it captures its prey or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Oh. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have already fallen victim to this plant 42. When we heard the stories from the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. <laughs> they got tentacles. Yeah. When the uniform petal like flaps open and reveals its vital internals, it has a tendency to become more aggressive. Of course it does. One witness reported it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves the way it does is still unknown. May 21st, 1998, Hemlock Grove, Helmolock. Henry Sar Sarton, Chris, not Moloch. <laughs> Freaking Moloch. It is Moloch. The <laughs> owl effigy. Mock sacrifices. To the plant. The plant god. Plant owl god Moloch. Mm. 
The plant has aligned itself with the desires of Moloch. <laughs> he has received his blessing and hence his power. Death if you want to claim his power for back. yourself, we have a uh, <laughs> merchandise in the store. <laughs> now 40% off for Thanksgiving. Resident key. Is there any of the resident key? Is there something? else in here no hot tub action for you water is leaking from the tank oh there's toilet water all over the floor that's so gross get the fuck out of my way <laughs> <laughs> he's a shit it's crossed him up he tried to act like he was coming in there all hot shit the zombies have been a pretty non-issue yeah they're kind of like they're the fun zombies where you can like kind of push them over like, you know, and they just fall on the ground and <laughs> you walk around them. And because you haven't had to kill a lot, it means you'll have to deal with less um, of the uh, the red ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not trying to kill any of the zombies unless they're really in my way. Um, I'll kill the dogs and stuff because they're more of a pain in the ass. And the dogs don't give you much of a choice. Yeah, and also they don't come back after I fucking kill them. They don't come back as red dogs. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I would bug me. Crimson head. Oh, jeez. Awesome Crimson dog head. Now yeah, let's keep it. <laughs> <laughs> I like holding on to keys. Yeah, give me more. If I remember correctly, there's... This is one of those secrets, just like, get a key to get another key. That's Resident Evil. Oh yeah, this guy. Hanging from the ceiling, like you do. He's not gonna drop down. <laughs> Guaranteed. How would he even do it? Yeah. Self-defense gun. Okay. Suicide note. Hmm. Had to do it. We ran from those things, helping each other to survive. Or Robert started to show the symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. Mm. There was no other way. We would have done the same if it were the other way around. After I put him out of his misery, I had to just leave him in the bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. <laughs> How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being part of this project. Eventually, I'll get what's coming to me, though. There's no way to escape from this nut house. It's just a matter of time. This Democratic Party is insane. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing that I'll leave many things undone is a regret beyond words. But this is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand and at least let me end my life as a person. Yeah, you didn't do a very good job. There's a message on the back. Linda, please forgive me. Hey. You didn't do a good job. You hung yourself, you stupid bastard. You should have <laughs> shot your brains out. You had a self-defense gun. Fucking idiot. What's the Concerned with literature and philosophy. Ew! There's nerds in here reading Shakespeare. Fucking gross. What are you reading Aristotle? Okay. I think. Socrates. Was that the defense gun? Was that it? Eh, there must be something in the bathroom. Yeah, that guy's in there. <laughs> I'm coming in. Coming I'm up the hallway. <laughs> Oh, was that the sound of him falling? Yes. They faked you out. The guy in the bathroom is supposed to still be alive. There's something inside the bathtub. It's a key. Wow. <laughs> Who would have guessed? It's to the ah! control room. Everything. I don't. There's nothing else left in this room. So it's just. They just have zombies in here just to freak you out. Just to get you moving. Yep. Sense a little sense of urgency and fear. I can feel it in my groins. Yeah, where else would you feel it? <laughs> the fear. That's where I... Everybody knows the fear is stored in the balls. <laughs> okay. Um. Yes, that's right. So... Yep, that room's good. Um. There was healing plants in here. I guess I can just grab them real quick. With what inventory space? Give me a second here. Just How many seconds does this Chris, guy need? Chris, you're standing. I want you to take a seat. All right, you're standing. <laughs> you're hovering. It's, it's making me feel. If you're standing at home, go ahead and leave a comment. <laughs> standing and watching. Hashtag stand gang. Mm. And if you think Ben has had enough seconds, mm -hmm. you let him know in those comments. 
Because I'm letting him know in person. And Ben reads the comments more than I do. Sometimes. Ben calls me like, hey, did you see this nice comment? Did you see? Yes, that's true. That is very true. I'm just grabbing some items real quick. Give me, give me some time here. Uh, again with the time on this guy. Because <laughs> I don't think once we get out of here, we don't come back. Pretty much, yeah. This will be one of those areas that we don't really need to come back to. Um, that was it for this room. Yep. All right, cool. Okay. I guess I'll just do this as well. Or... Hey, what are you doing over there? Don't worry about it. What are you doing, though? Minding my business. You ever heard of it? <laughs> You're always like this. Oh, why are you always like this? I have feelings. <laughs> ben always crying about his feelings. Mm -hmm. Yep. They're very important to me. They're the only ones you got. <laughs> so what next is the plant uh well yeah that'd be the next boss but we still have to take care of a little our little fishy friend neptune yes okay so neptune's next hmm. neptune well, really a... robbed well yeah i mean I'm, honestly how are you supposed to fight him otherwise it's like if they have you donned a swimming suit and there was a fucking swim section in this game i'd be pissed and you have to throw spears <laughs> oh, like dude. it's re4 <laughs> In the, in the remake of the remake, mm -hmm. they do that. I, I Honestly, it'll be so funny if they do end up remaking this. I'd play it. You'd give Capcom more of your fucking money. I'd spend 60 or $70 on it, yeah. Because <laughs> that would be sick. This game in the third person like that, I think, would be rad. You think, yeah, I would be kind of interested. Okay, I guess I could see that. At Here's least it would be thing. different. They can introduce a flashlight. Because I realized, I'm like, oh yeah, there's no flashlight in this game. Yeah, no. And then the original Aries, I don't think you have a flashlight either. I, I feel like Silent Hill was the first one to start the flashlight thing. Yeah, that could be. I think be. Silent Hill 1 had a flashlight. Yes, I'm pretty sure Silent one, Hill 1 did have Because these just have like spookily lit rooms, but no flashlight. In mm -hmm. this, they could have these be like pitch black. And yeah. like you with a flashlight with your gun going through. You can go like turn through. lights on or something. I don't know. Yeah, or light lamps. Yeah. They could have you add mechan they could add mechanics and stuff like that. Like that would be cool. Like just it would just make it way spookier walk around a big excuse me, haunted mansion yeah. by flashlight. And they could remove these box puzzles. Even though that's not really a puzzle, it's just like a sliding your the boxes across the floor. Yeah. Flashbacks to Resident Evil Zero. Yeah, the Resident Evil Zero one was way more tedious. Mm -hmm. But again, it was just RE one, but harder. Mm. Do, 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 do. Pushing a box down the corridor. Box. Did you pressure. end up deciding what thumbnail you're gonna use for Zero? Yeah. Okay. Because yeah, it's the one I sent you. Okay. At the time of viewing this, people are you well aware. Oh, yeah, of well aware of it. Yeah, it's the two of them. Okay, yeah. Hmm. Let's put a picture of your face, just all shocked with your hands on your cheeks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, like Home are alone. you with a gun, like <laughs> photoshopped in with them? <laughs> Maybe eventually we'll start doing shit like that <laughs> if we ever get tired. If you ever get tired of making the thumbnails the way you do. Um, I mean, they don't see us, so having us in the thumbnail feels like it doesn't Well, they matter. saw you. Did they? Well, you've left a comment on one of our videos. Oh, yeah, but they don't know that's me until you said something. Mm, I'm pretty sure people can put two on top of two when it comes to the name. I guess. 
Like, I stand by that comment. That's why I left it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That shit rips. I was playing that in my car. Like, that's how good it is. It was pretty. It is pretty damn good. I'm not going to lie. Ah. Dude, you're getting got. What oh, yeah. I tell you about getting got? I love getting I said specifically eaten by not to do it. <laughs> and. Hello! My wife. Oh, was it shark time? <laughs> it's shark time. It's shark o'clock. <laughs> This is the part where Neptune gets robbed mm -hmm. of all of his glory. There's no further use for it. Give it to the sharks. Because you stand here and you're like, man, what am I going to do about these sharks? Mm -hmm. What if I just took all their water away and they weren't a problem? <laughs> I mean, that's true, though. <laughs> or they could have a sequence where I well, poison the water. What if the they water? took all your land away, huh? How would you feel? <laughs> that's a swim. You feel bad. Oh. You humans think you got it so good. Okay. That's where he fakes you out by almost breaking the glass. Well, I have to, uh, here. Map. And then... Caution in Umbrella's case out here with their BYON, BYOM. Hmm. Build your own Megalodon. Mm-hmm. Case of drop in oil pressure, open valve one. Programs with main system, everything seems to be in proper working order. Beely Beely. Regulator. Just reacquainting myself with everything, because as soon as I do this. They start going to break the glass. Yep. Maybe it's this one. Air message. Something appears to have gone wrong while the water was being drained. There's a switch to drain the water? Yes. Shark time! Oh! Shark attack! Emergency. Um, no source of pressure, pressure detected. detected. Locking, all Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Okay, so if I remember... This guy can't even walk right. I think it was. There's no need to adjust. Which? Reaching 30% ah. of pressure threshold. Yes. Okay. Oil. God damn it. Um. Ooh. Okay. Then you gotta press the. It said one. Okay. Then. Oh. My sweet lord. I release the safety again. Oh. What a bitch. Yes. Reaching 70% of pressure threshold. This part always frazzles me. Even if I have a, a good understanding what to do. <laughs> yeah. It's a little scary. Alrighty. I mean, that's 70%. That's a lot of percent. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now we drain Zavata. Flush the toilet. Poor Neptune. Hmm. Yeah, that sucks he didn't get to eat me. <laughs> yeah. It's he deserved better. Mm. I'm wondering if they, if they did remake it, how would they even make it a fight? Would they just make you fight on, a like, platforms? Like, you <laughs> jump between platforms and, like, have you shoot him or something like that? Yeah. Or just a uh, water temple link. You got some heavy boots. Yeah. <laughs> and you dropped out. Like, you got to go, like, you got to put on, like, a water suit and go in there. Ah, oh, dude, that would be. Like a harpoon. That'd be weird. They had a swim sequence in the game. Like, you have to go in there to release a lever. Mm-hmm. It oh, could be their way of ripping off of, like, the dead space's vacuum of space. Yeah. That may be kind of interesting. But I feel like they'd have to fill more of the game with water sections if they're going to put an entire, like, 
the mechanics like that into the game. Well, the whole basement's flooded. Mm -hmm. So there's that. Mm. They could introduce it there. Like, <clears throat> swim mechanics to, like, get underneath the plant yeah. that's, like, dangling in there. I got ideas, man. I've got ideas. <laughs> but then it's like, you know, it's the cursed chalice thing. Like, these games are so beloved. Like, if you change too much, people get mad. But they changed a lot in the RE2 remake, and it was all good. Yeah, it was. And they changed a bit in the 4 remake. They I'm changed just like... a lot in RE3, but it wasn't well received, but that was a different team. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is that magnum ammo in there? Yeah, I'm going to wait to grab it because there's um, there's an item I think I have to grab in here. As, or maybe there might be a couple items in here that I need to grab. I want to make sure I have enough space for everything. But also, I mean, they don't need to do all that to make Neptune cool. Ari has a way of just like trivializing their water monsters. Mm -hmm. You always get one scene where they look cool. Like in Ari 4, I'm pretty sure you see the big lake monster eat something. Yeah. And then I and then in a RE eight, you see that big lake monster fuck shit up. So they, you always get to see them fuck something up, and then they do the fight. That's oh, a puzzle. They boss. always yeah. And then RE seven or the one with the werewolves. That's eight. Eight. Yeah, they have the yeah. There's that yeah. They have the water monster fight there too. Yeah, they always have one crazy water monster, and then it gets then the fight is like a trivialized puzzle. Yeah, that's very true. It's just the learn game mechanics. Ow, I fucked up. <laughs> it shocks you and it's like, wow, it looks like it could electrocute you. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> there we go. Throwing the toaster into the water. This is how you kill a shark. Bye, Neptune. Yeah. Fra, motherfucker, fra. <laughs> Be nice. <laughs> Deep sixed. Yeah. <laughs> you just got deep sixed. That was fucking stupid. Poor baby boy. Mm. I'm sorry, Quiz. He's dead. I love you, Neptune. <laughs> Rest easy. You You're going to be eating other predators in the afterlife. Mm -hmm. ah. Why can't he be like this shark? Surviving, yet docile. Well, Neptune found a little bit of water that he could but he just couldn't move mm. you put him out of his misery it's fine yep. it's fine I'm, i'll be all right wipe my tears away is that a tear shut up <laughs> are shut you up. crying be nice to me <laughs> shark's dead shark's dead <laughs> i want a big stuffed shark with a bunch of scars on him and be like this is neptune yeah they, I mean, hell, you probably find that pretty easy, actually. Give me a Neptune plush. Mm. I want a plush of all of the Resident Evil bosses. Oh, yeah. Even Salad Bar? <laughs> Especially Salad Bar. <laughs> Alright, I gotta... I gotta come back down here. Because I'm not leaving that Magnum memo behind. Yeah. That'll be useful. I don't know. Maybe the maybe I'll use the grenade launcher on the plant boss, and then I'll use the magnum on the final boss. Save it for him. Yeah. The only other thing that's been happening this week, and I feel like by the time this comes out, I will have been told to fuck off if mm. they're going to tell me to fuck off, or I'll be told to fuck on if they're mm. going to tell me to fuck on. Fuck on, fuck off. At work. Like, it's been getting super crazy, and we're kind of understaffed a little bit. You know, Everybody. the story of everybody's life. Yeah. But we're understaffed by, like, one or two people. Like, we're like it's fine. It's just I would like to alleviate some of my employees, like, workload and bring some other people on. Mm -hmm. But, like, the budget isn't really there. So I'm like, well, how do I solve this problem with my existing workforce? Mm -hmm. So I was like, all right, let's solve this problem. And the solution to the problem is transitioning everybody to four tens. Because it allows my evening team to overlap with my morning team. And my morning team has the most of the like the volume and workload. Mm -hmm. And the evening team coming in later isn't really helping with that. I mean, mm. they, they can take stuff over that doesn't get finished. Yeah. But it still puts a lot of the shoulders on the morning team. I'm like, well, how can I help my evening team help my morning team? 
and I was like, we'll have them overlap, but, but we still need the coverage in the evening. So I can't just move everybody earlier. So I'm like, but if I can transition everybody to four tens, it'd overlap by four hours Yeah. during the peak hours of the day. Mm -hmm. And I busted on my schedule and like worked it all out. So now you got um, everybody working I'm meeting four with people with like vice president and senior and chief in their name oh. uh, or in their title. Mm -hmm. Uh, to plead my case i mean they don't even know about any of this like but tomorrow will be when, when you drop I, the ball drop yeah, the bomb drop the bomb yeah because i'm a part of me thinks they're just going to be like you know not my monkey not my circus like you up you up <laughs> you run this team if you think it you figured it out yeah and it saves the company money and then like because it just spreads the work out it's basically everybody does less because mm -hmm. there's more people doing it and it yeah it just it solves every goddamn problem so hmm. well, and hopefully. everybody will be stoked i mean four tens are always better so. yeah yeah so if it gets approved and i get to save the company money while also giving all of my team members a better schedule mm -hmm. i get to be the champion of champions yeah there you go i hope it works out then yeah i mean good. also i mean it just it makes sense like when i wrote it out and i showed my other manager she was like Wow, this solves every problem. How can we never thought of this? And I was like, because in our heads, we just figured we we can't do that. Yeah. And I was like, wait, we're in charge. <laughs> we're the leaders of our own making kind wait, of thing. <laughs> we're, we're the adults here. <laughs> our team call us mom and dad, mm -hmm. which is funny because I think of my boss as mom. Mm -hmm. So when I had somebody refer to me and my other manager like as mom and dad. dad, I was like, whoa. <laughs> I'm the it was dad. Literally they tagged us as like mom, dad. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, oh, I love that. <laughs> That's pretty good. You need to do I was going to say, I think everywhere, it, everywhere seems to be short staffed nowadays. My work short staffed. I think where Tyler and Brittany work, they might be short staffed. Yeah, it's um, funny. One of their recruiters hit me up on LinkedIn. And uh, I was like, oh, I make more money than this. And I love my company. I love my job. Um, so I was like, I'm not interested, but I know a bunch of people who work for you. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm like, if I know anybody looking, I'll let you know. And it's funny, my older brother messaged me the other day looking for a job. He's like, do you know anybody that's hiring? And I was like, funny enough, I do. Mm -hmm. Our little brother's employer is hiring. Yep. So I sent that recruiter um, his info. Oh. And then I sent him the recruiter's info. So hopefully that works out. Mm. It'll be funny, too, because if he gets hired, I get a referral for it from that like recruiting agency oh nice they're like yeah we'll give you a we'll pay you out for the referral and i'm like man tyler and Brittany are gonna be so mad like hey that was our referral money <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they, they will be upset by that <laughs> hey what the fuck man I'm uh, like, hey i just this dude was in my dm yeah. like, i didn't mean to take your money it just happened that way hey man i'm trying to get mine <laughs> get out of here you got him a job at our place of work and you get the money for mm -hmm. it? Yep. I'm trying to remember if I need this right now. I'm but yeah, we're only short staffed because we fired a bunch of people. Mm. And they needed to be fired. Yeah. Um, and then it's just because 2023 has been so everybody's preparing for a recession so all like the the budget i call it the the coin purse is yeah. being has a death grip on it which i'm like it's fair you don't want to go spending money like crazy but i love spending money like crazy <laughs> i just love it if it gets approved I, although i feel because like my boss is out of the office she's on a sabbatical mm. so i'm meeting with my boss's boss's boss <laughs> Uh oh <laughs> yeah that's why it's like chief and senior and vice president mm -hmm. and like All are, the are the titles names. of the people i'm meeting with this because my boss isn't it but it'd be funny because she'll come back and be like anything to talk about like yeah i completely restructured our team <laughs> I could, yeah actually while you were gone we changed everything mm -hmm. yep <laughs> well i'm like prepare to be surprised well it sucks that she's gone because i think i could have if I'd shown her this she would have been all for it she go oh yeah absolutely that makes total sense mm -hmm. like I don't know why we never did this before. Because you guys are freaking idiots. Because we never needed it before. Mm -hmm. It was like the the workload was like spread so evenly it would never occur to us. So yeah. people brought up four tens were like, what? For why? Mm -hmm. But now I'm like, it actually makes sense. And it's good four tens. Like everybody has either Monday or Friday off, no splits. Oh, nice. Because Friday is like our slowest weekday. 
Although split days off can be cool. Yeah. Because then it's like two days on, one day off, two days on, two days off. It's like you never work a full week. Mm. I've done that before, and that's actually kind of rad. And because your third day is kind of bullshit anyway, because all none of your unless your friends have four tens too. Yeah. So just having a second Sunday. God. Ah. Fucking bees. The worst enemy in the game. No, the dogs are the worst enemy in the game. Yeah. Agree to disagree. Yeah, take that, you fucking bugs. I wonder if this inspired the Cheryl scene in uh, Silent Hill 3, where she mixes the mustard gas to, to gas out the, oh, yeah. the swarm. I, did for I forgot about that. I'm only thinking of it because... At the time of us recording this, episode it's, one of Silent Hill 3 just came out. Yep. And episode, like, five is when we have the audio fix. Mm. All right. So, key, resident key. Resident, resident key. Vol. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey. And that's the end of this episode. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, like, subscribe, leave a comment. Etc. Etc. We love you. See mm. you on the next one. Bye. Bye.